In this problem, we want to find the following compositions. So we're given f of x is equal to 3x minus 2, and g of x is equal to 4x squared minus 3x. And the first thing we want to find is the composition of f and g, which is f of g. So we're going to take f of x, and everywhere we have an x, we'll put it in parentheses. So 3x minus 2, we'll put in parentheses in for the x. So we've got 3 times the set of parentheses minus 2. Now this is just evaluating the function, so whatever's inside the parentheses right here is automatically what we're going to put in down here. This is g, and g was 4x squared minus 3x. Well, 3 times 4x squared gives us 12x squared. 3 times negative 3x is negative 9x, and then I'll bring down the minus 2. And this one, we want to find the composition of g and f, which is g of f. So we're going to take our g of x, which is 4x squared minus 3x, and everywhere we have an x, we'll put in parentheses. So I've got 4 times the set of parentheses squared minus 3 times the set of parentheses. Now, whatever's inside the parentheses right here is automatically what we're going to put in down here. But this is f, and f was 3x minus 2. So, we want to simplify. 3x minus 2 squared is 3x minus 2 times 3x minus 2. Negative 3 times 3x is negative 9x. Negative 3 times negative 2 is positive 6. Multiply these together. 3x times 3x is 9x squared. 3x times negative 2 is negative 6x. Negative 2 times 3x is negative 6x. Negative 2 times negative 2 is positive 4. Minus 9x plus 6. So I got 4 times 9x squared. Combine together the like terms. Negative 6x and negative 6x is negative 12x. Multiply the 4 through. 4 times 9 gives us 36x squared. 4 times negative 12 is negative 48x. 4 times 4 is 16. Minus 9x plus 6. Which gives us 36x squared minus 48x and, and negative 9x gives us negative 57x. And 16 plus uh, 6 gives us 22. Assuming I added and subtracted right, that's our answer. Now C is to find the composition of f and g and then plug 3 in for x. So we're evaluating. So we're going to continue. We already found a composition of f and g in part a. We're going to continue from the 12x squared minus 9x minus 2, and we'll put 3 in for the x. So I've got 12 times 3 squared minus 9 times 3 minus 2. Uh, 3 squared is 9, minus 9 times 3 is 27, minus 2, which gives us 12 times 9 is um, 108. Negative 27, negative 2 is negative 29, which gives us 79, assuming I added and subtracted right. So those are our answers.